Hola, cafeño. We're Cafe Conlanger Travels. I'm David. And I'm Travis. And today we are traveling to Guadalajara. Ah, Mexico's second largest city. We can't wait to check you out. So let's go. vegan restaurant we're about to eat literally everything everything we're so excited because they have torta ahogada the vegan so we get to have the specialty but plant-based impressions of Guadalajara. It is hip, it is artsy, it is a city. Yeah, it's oh. very cool. It's also raining. Yes. So. Okay, we are back at the Airbnb. Yes, after a day of eating and wandering around getting lost. The rain interrupted our first impressions, but first impressions so far? I love Guadalajara. It is artsy, it is hipstery, there's a lot of younger people here. It feels like your quintessential downtown art field area. We read that it was, I think, the gayest or among the gayest cities in Mexico. And you can tell, because it's awesome. And anywhere the gays go, we make it look good. We light it up. So you're welcome, <laughs> world. Uh, but seriously, like, there's so many really cute cafes and plant shops and little cool restaurants that we want to eat at, all of them. We're digging you, Guadalajara. We've been here for six hours. We were already talking about moving, so... I like it a lot. It's real nice. So this is our fantastic Airbnb because we always use amazing for everything. It was very affordable. It has an amazing view, great windows that light this place up. The whole wall of the balcony is retractable, so that's really nice. Yeah. The 
bed is super comfy. Fully stocked kitchen, which is key because we're gonna be here for a while. So we do wanna try a bunch of restaurants and cafes, but we also don't wanna break the bank. <laughs> the one thing we were kind of concerned about is it doesn't have air conditioning. But. Which coming from Merida was like, Oh God. We even messaged them first to say, uh, is there a fan or anything? Which there is a fan, but it was 88 degrees here today and it felt amazing. It has like this breeze that's constant and there's no humidity. So it has felt amazing, especially with these big, huge windows. You just leave them open and the breeze comes right in. And it also has a washer dryer, which is great. We will leave the link to this property in the description below. The lovely woman who checked us in mentioned that they run a couple of the properties in this building and then uh, have like 10 other properties in the neighborhood. So if this isn't available, shoot them a message and maybe they have some of their other properties. But they were great, seamless check-in, really helpful. Yes. Five out of five coffee cups. <laughs> I used to live downtown in Kansas City in a loft, and this kind of reminds me of that kind of downtown city loft vibe. So if you're into that, you will love this Airbnb. We are never leaving. <laughs> Don't tell Merida. But Guadalajara, we see you. Guadalajara has our heart of us. Gu <laughs> Guadalajara. <laughs> Guadalajara to leave. Guadalajara. <laughs> 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 We are gonna be in Guadalajara for a little bit. So we're gonna take you guys everywhere with us. We're gonna take you on adventures. We're gonna take you on places to eat. We are gonna go all over the place in Guadalajara. So get ready. There's so much to do and we're so excited to try to get it all in. What? <laughs> <laughs> there is so much to do in Guadalajara and we're excited to try to do it all. Yes. And take you along. We make new videos every Thursday, so make sure you like and subscribe and all the YouTube things to stay in tune with what we are doing. All right, here comes our tagline. Hasta luego. We'll see you next time.